have been in the historic district for 30 years. I've been in this particular house for 17 years. We had a meeting with Pam Hodge at the city pretty much telling us that they have $10 million to spend on a uh, new parking garage, and which will be constructed in the parking lot right here next door. We asked questions like, okay, how many stories is it? Well, we don't know. Where's the ingress and egress? How do you get in and out of it? Is it gonna be on front? Is it gonna be where it currently is? Or is it gonna be on Broadway? Well, we don't know. We don't know. Um, so, I feel like they're just going at it without a plan. I equate it to pulling up to the parking garage store and saying, give me $10 million worth. I think it ought to be done on the other side of front, you know, where the existing parking garage is. They have done some renovations to the Trade Center, I understand. They're looking to bring bigger groups of people in, which I understand that too. Uh, but with those bigger groups and more people comes more traffic. So it, it, that must always be kept in mind. Uh, and when I questioned it, I was given a diagram of some improvements they were gonna make to 8th Street. This is another concern. And one of them for controlling traffic and slowing it down was to put a roundabout where 8th Street meets 2nd Avenue. A bigger concern for me is part of the reason that this neighborhood is a recognized historic district is our grid pattern streets and i've talked to people and it was on the original the it was mentioned and noted in the original application for this to become a so i think when you if you go messing with it with a roundabout then then someone said oh it'll be a small roundabout well you're still gonna have to cut into the curbs and make room for people to get around and i th if i'm not mistaken i even asked the question of pam so you're telling me that this is a done deal. It's gonna happen. And she said, yes. Uh, which concerns me. Uh, I mean, how do you say it's a done deal if you don't even know what it's gonna cost, what it's gonna look like?